hello guys you're welcome to my channel this video is going to be a very short one i'm just trying to show you how i take down three week old um braids this is a protective style that i installed in the last that i showed you how i installed in the last video if you haven't watched it yet please do watch it i show you how i do triangular braids okay so the thing that i really want to emphasize on in taking down a protective style especially one that has stayed this long is that you have to be very careful with the build up at the base and this is even going to be worse if you use extensions right you're going to have that build up there which is maybe from product and also i guess dust or you know just stuff that you pick up as you sit on the chair and stuff like that so you're going to have that build up at the base for sure so you want to be careful when you when you're detangling that build up when you're taking it apart okay because there's going to be some hairs some um some shed hairs that you know probably fell off during when you had the style on and it just kind of stuck there because of the plait. so you want to make sure that you're gently removing them together with the build up and not letting it you know rip out more hair as it's you know as you're taking it down which is why i usually go in with something that has slipped like a, a detangler which i didn't have in this case so i use some oil you go in with that product uh, that has some slip and apply it to that gunk before you you know detangle and that really helps because if you just go right in and start combing out that build up without putting some uh you know a product on there with you know with some kind of a detangler or product with slip it can be aloe it could be oil whatever then you're going to cause unnecessary breakage if you've been watching my channel for some time you know that we are really big on um and properly detangling after you take down a hairstyle before you shampoo your hair during my days of ignorance i would just take down my hairstyle and just go into the shower and wash and then i wonder why i had so much shedding happening we don't do that anymore and it's it's paying off right i always make sure no matter how how lazy or oh, sorry how how much in a hurry i am we have to detangle the hair combing out gently in small sections like i'm doing now and that's after you've detangled a little bit with your fingers and then you go in with my uh, with a comb i always like to go in with this big comb this is really a good comb for afro hair because it doesn't have like small teeth and then you, co you comb it out and then you put the hair in some twists in preparation for wash day okay so this is highly critical if you want to retain length you have to do this you cannot afford to just take down a hairstyle and then go into the shower and wash your hair without detangling because you're going to cause unnecessary breakage if you do that okay so that's really what i want to share with you there isn't there isn't much else i usually use detangler my favorite detangler right now is aunt jackie's not on my watch i'm going to put it right here it's a really good detangler and i think it's about maybe eight dollars I buy it at the local grocery store uh, I, I mean walmart i buy it at walmart it's you know about eight dollars or seven dollars and fifty cents i don't i don't remember but it's not expensive and usually i can use it for like two two um two rounds of detangling for both my daughters so it it does you know it, it does uh last um, that's kind of my favorite product for detangling i ran out and i didn't you know i didn't remember to buy it before we took down this style so i was using oil which still works because it has the slip necessary to remove that build up at the base so i was still able to use it but ideally you would want to use a detangler or at least a product that has slip like aloe 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 juice or aloe gel or whatever yeah all right so that's that's all i wanted to show you in this video and i hope that that was useful to someone to i mean this is something this is like one of the step <laughs> one is it's 101 right it's it's afro hair 101 i'm pretty sure there's no one that's you know trying to uh be, be natural you know keeping your natural hair healthy i don't think there's anyone who's not doing this but you just never know there are people starting their journey they might not know this or they might take it for granted so i guess a video like this never hurts right all right, do let me know uh, in the comment section what are your favorite products for detangling and if you uh, detangle at all if you've seen any benefits from doing this let me know 
all right thank you so much for watching this video and uh, see you next time